Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we are dealing with the difference between isotropic and anisotropic minerals in mineral optics. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned and enjoy this captivating content. Isotropic minerals are those that exhibit uniform physical properties in all directions. In terms of optical properties, isotropic minerals behave the same regardless of the direction in which light passes through them. They have a single refractive index, meaning they do not exhibit birefringence. This is in contrast to anisotropic minerals, which have different physical properties depending on the direction in which they are measured. Isotropic minerals have a single refractive index, meaning that light passing through them is not split into two rays with different velocities as it would in anisotropic minerals. Isotropic minerals have uniform appearance. When viewed under a microscope with cross-polarized light, isotropic minerals appear dark or uniformly colored, regardless of the orientation of the microscope stage or the polarization filters. Isotropic minerals do not exhibit birefringence, which is the phenomenon where light passing through a material is split into two rays with different velocities, resulting in double refraction. Examples of isotropic minerals include garnets, isometric crystals, and glass. Most garnets are isotropic, although some varieties may exhibit weak anomalous birefringence. Minerals belonging to the isometric crystal system, such as diamond, spinel, and halite, rock salt, are typically isotropic. Glass is an amorphous material that lacks a regular crystalline structure and therefore exhibits isotropic behavior. Anisotropic minerals are minerals that exhibit different physical properties when measured along different crystallographic directions. This phenomenon is particularly evident in their optical properties, where the minerals display varying behaviors depending on the orientation of light passing through them. Anisotropic minerals typically have more than one refractive index, leading to double refraction or birefringence. Anisotropic minerals exhibit birefringence, meaning that when light passes through them, it is split into two rays traveling at different speeds. This results in the phenomenon of double refraction, where the mineral appears to produce two distinct images when viewed under a microscope with cross-polarized light. When viewed under a microscope with cross-polarized light, anisotropic minerals display varying colors and brightness depending on the orientation of the mineral relative to the polarization filters. As the mineral is rotated on the microscope stage, the colors and intensity of light change, providing important information about its crystallographic structure. Refractive index, optical extinction, and pleochroism, that is, variation in color or intensity when viewed from different angles, are all physical properties of anisotropic minerals. These properties depend on the crystallographic orientation of the mineral relative to the direction of light propagation. Examples of anisotropic minerals include calcite, quartz, and micas. Calcite is a common anisotropic mineral that exhibits strong birefringence. When viewed under a microscope, calcite crystals often display vivid interference colors and characteristic cleavage patterns. Quartz is another example of an anisotropic mineral, although its birefringence is typically weaker compared to minerals like calcite. Different varieties of quartz may exhibit varying degrees of birefringence and optical behavior. Minerals in the mica group, such as muscovite and biotite, are anisotropic due to their layered crystal structure. They often show distinct basal cleavage and varying optical properties when viewed under polarized light. In conclusion, isotropic minerals have uniform properties in all directions, while anisotropic minerals exhibit directional dependence in their properties, particularly in their optical behavior. Thank you for joining us today. Until next time, cheers!